For my father, the scoreboard was only one aspect of winning. Make no mistake, by proclaiming that it isn't winning or losing that has lasting value or importance, he was not suggesting that the final outcome of the scoreboard was unimportant. On the contrary, his 14 conference titles, three national championships, and win streaks of 31, and then 47 straight games in a row during a 17-year period gave testimony to the fact that winning mattered a great deal to him. His philosophy, however, was not about the final outcome of a game or life event. It was more about the journey to reach the final goal. Winning the Wilkinson Way is about a process in which your values and your attitude, your preparation and your perseverance, coupled with your dedication and your sacrifice for a cause and for your team and for your company are what matter most. Success is simply a natural and inevitable extension of that process. The same holds true with your company or organization. The scoreboard is represented by weekly, monthly, and annual sales, revenue, and bottom line goals and objectives. But winning also is simply doing your best at all times. And winning is always treating your coworkers, vendors, and clients with dignity and respect. And winning sometimes is simply getting home from work at night and fixing dinner and reading to the kids at bedtime. Winning sometimes is getting a child into college, and if need be, that same child into rehab. Winning the Wilkinson way means that winning literally takes care of itself, whether at the end of a game, a project, a personal crisis, or simply at the end of a day.